All right, guys. Uh, I got something cool to show you. Uh, this one is going to dabble a little bit in, um, I guess you could say, home automation. Um, except there's a little difference with what I'm doing. Um, I have a Belkin Wemo. If you don't know what that is, it's basically Z-Wave Home Automation Alternatives. Um, I have this particular one right here, but I also have, I'm going to buy this one uh, probably tomorrow, but then I also have this one with the motion sensor. Now these plug into your wall and you can do all sorts of cool things, namely um, turn on or off devices from your smartphone. I'm using it a little bit different. I'm using a service called IFTTT. Now what that is is called if that then this. That's what it's abbreviated for. I it's IFTTT. It's if that then this. So let me show you real quick. So if this and it'll say, what do you want? You know, I don't know. Um, it's like, it's like I get a, if I get a text message. Um, oh, bad example. Uh, stay on page. If... Um, I can hear you. Go to sleep. Entering sleep mode. Say wake up to start recognition. Okay. I can hear you. If... You know, I get a new photo that's tagged, or this is just one out of many, one out of many in, uh, differences you can do. Um, so if I get tagged in a photo on Instagram, then this will happen. So I can, I don't know, I can choose it to send me a text message. You know, send me a text message. Anyway, you can do all sorts of really, really cool things. Uh, what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to use the service um, to where if I send an email to the if that then this uh, then it will trigger the Belkin switch which I have plugged into a, uh, a lamp okay and I'm going to show you that here in a moment so basically what I'm going to get Denise to do is in the brain editor I'm going to have her say, well, I'm, I'm going to say, turn the lamp off. And in turn, that's going to send an email to trigger at ifttt.com. And then the subject is going to be hashtag off. Okay. Uh, there doesn't need to be a second one for hashtag on. Like, I don't need to make a separate one for on because there's already one for off and um, if I when I do make a second one it's just gonna be turn the lamp on from here it's not gonna be the actual t in between the templates it's just that one because when you send it the email with a subject of off it regardless if it's off or on it's just gonna switch whether it's on or off on the device it's gonna just basically switch so um, I don't need to make two AIMLs with the exception of the pattern. So th for this particular one, I'm going to say turn the lamp off and she's going to send the email and it's going to trigger the the uh, device to um, turn off. <laughs> so um, I'm going to try it. I'm going to pause the video and uh, I'm going to compile the AIML and uh, I'm going to get my, my camera out on my phone and gonna record it and we're gonna see if it works okay be right back okay <clears throat> I uh, compiled AIML and uh, as you can see it's in the folder where it's lamp off and lamp on um, if you remember what I said just a little while ago it's gonna send an email to that trigger at ifttt.com uh, with the subject line of hashtag off uh, so I'm going to open up Denise and we are going to test it. Okay. Well, that 
take forever. Okay. Good evening, Dominique. My systems and functions are fully operational. How can I help you? Go to chat. Go to chat. Turn the lamp off. Okay. Sending your email. Please wait. Your email was sent with success. Okay, I gotta figure that out to go to sleep. Entering sleep mode. Say wake up to start recognition. Okay, I thought it would be automatic. Uh, it's not. I'm gonna have to mess with it a little bit. But I'm looking and my lamp is still on. So I have to tinker with it a little bit. I'm gonna hit pause on the video and I'm gonna see if I can get it working the way it should and I'll be back. Okay, I figured it out. Uh, the problem was that my email system in Denise was set to her personal email that I set up for her. She has her own personal email. And when I set up the service on uh, If That Then This, um, it requires me to send it from my personal email because my account is tied into my personal email. So what I did was I set up my personal email uh, within Denise and at first it didn't work because by default her um, email address is the default email for the whole system but I just switched my personal one as uh, preparing new email the as the uh, default opening configuration module let's see here See, so I set up mine as the default, so it's going to send email from mine first off before it d attempts to send it with hers. So uh, it works. So I'm going to show you right now. Hold on. Let me. I can hear you. Turn the lamp off. Send email. What does this refer to? Send email. Sending your email. Please wait. Your email was sent with success. There it is. Go to sleep. Where? Go to sleep. Entering sleep mode. Say wake up to start recognition. So it worked. Uh, this is something that I have set up to where I don't need a home automation hub. Uh, most home automation uh, setups require a hub of sorts where it's basically like a, a control center, like it's like a brain for the home automation. This uh, does everything over the internet. So uh, I don't need a hub. All I need is uh, the if that then this service where it doesn't matter how I send the email to the the predetermined email that I'm supposed to send a trigger to, uh, it can work without a home automation hub. I can send it from my cell phone, the email, if I want it. And as long as it's from my personal email address, send it to the correct email address that I'm supposed to trigger it with the subject line of hashtag off, it will work. And as you can see, it did. So just something that I wanted to show you guys. I think it's really cool. Um, I want to say thanks to everyone who's given me lots of props on these videos. Um, again, I don't have much, much uh, motivation to make these, but I just do it to help you guys out, to show you that Denise is not useless. You can do so many things with her, and uh, this is just one out of many things. So subscribe to the channel. Follow me on Twitter, at Dom on Air, and uh, leave a comment. Um, yeah, and let me know if you got any questions. Thanks for watching.